Tonight is the night, the unveiling of a massive, highly anticipated sports complex that really promises to be among the very best in central Arkansas. And that complex is having its grand opening in the city of Cabot right now. Channel 7's Ashley Lunningham joins us now live from Cabot from the grand opening of Game Time at the Grounds. Ashley. Must be something in the air, some pollen, right? Chris Beth, yeah, right now I'm right behind me. The ceremony is going on right now, and they're about to cut that ribbon to let the community of Cabot and the surrounding areas in to get a glimpse at game time at the grounds. A project years in the making has finally come to life, opening the doors for the first time to the community. Travis Young with City of Cabot says on just one side of the facility. We have lines for basketball, six high school reg regulation, basketball courts, turns into 12 volleyball courts, turns into 18 pickleball courts. The other side, two indoor AstroTurf fields for anything from soccer to football, as well as batting cages and a unique twist to outdoor sports. We want to bring a unique style of baseball and softball. We'll also have some dodgeball, lacrosse, uh, different sports that we typically don't play indoors. We're, we will make adjustments to those uh, on the turf side to be able to play those indoors here. During the week, the center will be open to the community to utilize. And during the weekend... Our recreation programs are awesome. Uh, we have right now we have 2,500 kids participating in five youth sports, and then the fall is even bigger than that because we go to seven sports. And so with that, um, but we also use these facilities economic generators on the weekends. And we have 21 weekends already planned out for events here over the next year. Cabot resident Mike Thomas says he plans to be at the grand opening to finally see the new facility completely finished. So I voted for it and was real, real happy to, to see it come in. You know, I think it'd be a real asset to the, to the city. Young says on top of the financial impact it will have on the city, giving kids in the community a place to go was another plus. We want to have a building where we can allow the community to come in uh, and kids have a place to go. Um, and, and that's so much of it is, hey, esports is a huge thing now, but at the same time, we want uh, kids to be able to come in, do some type of recreation here, and we believe we have something here that everybody can do. Hey, Brian. Now Young says on the this following Monday, they're going to open up the courts for the first time, having their first local volleyball tournament. And then that following Tuesday, they're going to open it up for the community to enjoy. In Cabot, on your side, I'm Ashley Lenning. All right, Ashley, thanks a lot. It will cost $5 per person to get into game time. For more information, look for this story over on our website, katv.com.